Uh, hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to Late to the Game. Hey, what's going on? I'm, I'm Chris Ham. I'm Carl. And today we're gonna take a little trip to Dragon Wings Comic. Oh, I got, <laughs> I got the S's all wrong. Whoa, there's some crazy shit happening right here. Oh, Dragon's Wing. Oh my God. Yeah, that nerd just got fucked in the ass by that policeman officer. And I'll then he take that coke. regurgitated a coke. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Cop hit him so hard he puked a coke can. Oh, okay. So, right. oh, sh oh, you're in trouble now. Oh, we we're off to a bad start. Bad start indeed. There we go. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna take a trip to the little comic store here because uh, this consumer. Consumo. We talked about it. We said we were gonna play it. Here it is. We're gonna put our quarter in, and here we go. Oh, that would. So oh, I'm playing. Okay. Hey, Chris Hamm is here playing now with Kudzubo. Okay, I think, it's, I think it's fitting that Chris Hamm play this game. I do love to eat so much. Uh, healthy food, rotten food. Avoid the blowfish. Subo bounces you around. Pretty simple. Uh, cool. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. You're right, dude. This is uh this is pretty funny. I like this. I'm glad that you like it. Good, I'm glad that you're glad. Oh my god. Oh oh I ate a rotten fish, I guess I'm okay. So you just eat food and get big? Mm-hmm. Nice. It happens gradually. Like if I didn't tell you that you got big, you probably wouldn't know it. Until, like, much later. Oh, yeah, I got a little bigger. Like a teeny tiny bit. Boop. How big could he get? Huge. Like, oh. almost not being able to avoid anything huge? Yeah. Nice. Like, like gargantuan, ridiculous. <laughs> I like that. Gargantuan, ridiculous. <laughs> Gonna let these come to me. Ooh, big apple. Fish. Rice. 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 Fish. Boom. Huh. Huh. I do like, uh, I really like simplistic games like this. Yeah. Like, if it's fun and controls well and has a nice hook to it, like, there's something to be said about, like, I don't know, like, it doesn't have to be some big giant. Like, I know this is a game within a much more complicated game, but, oh. Not everything has to be, you know... Glitz and glamour. Yeah, not everything has to be GTA and God of War to to still be a lot of fun. Yeah, this game... Seriously, I've spent so many hours playing this game. Yeah, I know. I saw your high score on it. It's insane. Within Bully. Well, it's a mission, actually. You oh, really? To, yeah, you have to, like, beat... <gasps> Oh. You have to beat one of the nerd's high scores in order to proceed with the game, so... Nerd! <laughs> Fucking nerd! But I don't think his was 1,500. I think it was less than that. Oh, well, then you trounced him. Yeah, that kinda. was your high score. Uh-huh. 1,556, maybe? I don't remember. We'll see at the end. Yeah, it was something like that. Oh, God! Yeah, that was imminent death, and you <laughs> totally avoided it like a champion pro. Thank you. <laughs> that I missed all of those. <laughs> oh, totally whiffed it. Whiffer. Oh, oh. Goddamn sumo wrestlers. Yeah, so basically the other sumo wrestlers running around that are not Chris Ham bounce you all over the world place. All over the everywhere place is where you get bounced if you touch them. If you touch them... I like that the music sounds like, I don't know, like old school Street Fighter music or something. Yeah, but it's got that, like, Japanese twist to it. Yeah. Oh, oh God. I almost hit a blowfish. Dude. So would it be a pun if you did hit a blowfish and died finally? If I was like, you blow. Uh, I don't know. Is that a pun? Uh, I don't know if that's a pun. That wouldn't be a pun, I think. This is where, if we ever had listener reaction, that would come in handy. 
Yeah. Would that punter. be a pun? Pun or no pun? We're gonna take a poll, and two of you are gonna respond to it, and it's gonna be a tie. We're gonna take a poll. That's how it and always then, And then catch a blowfish with it. <laughs> what? See, that's a pun. No, that's not a pun. That's not a pun. That's at like all. a play on words. I don't know. Oh god! Oh, he almost knocked me into a fucking blowfish. I don't think that qualifies for play on words even. Is it blowfish? Is the one that like. You have to be like a licensed like sushi fucking master to be able to make, right? Because it's got some kind of like toxic sack that if you don't cut it out just perfectly, like you'll kill whoever eats it. I don't know, but I like the sound of toxic sack. That's <laughs> fucking awesome. <laughs> Hello, my name is Carl, and I have a toxic sack. Whoa. Why don't you come home with me and find out what that's all about? <laughs> Like I'm picking up some chicken a bar. Yeah, that's how I started off. <laughs> Need to work on your uh, <laughs> work on your game a little. <laughs> Listen to some PUA. I heard that if you wear a Podcasts. red shirt, I heard that if you wear a red shirt, you walk into a bar and you look disgruntled and mean, and you walk up to a girl and tell her that your immune system's good. That that works. You have literally flabbergasted me. I have no idea what to say to that. Um, it, it was on the radio. There was like one of those. Um, if you're wearing a red shirt mm -hmm. and you look upset, you look disgruntled. Yeah, and like you walk up to a girl and say, "I have a good immune system." <laughs> well, the the immune system part probably won't work, but if you've got a good amount of testosterone, you wear a red shirt and you look mean. Girls like that. Really? From, according to some magazine. What magazine? Never gotten laid in my life magazine? Yeah, that might have been the one. Oh, okay. I tend to read that it's a, good a lot. Magazine, yeah. yeah, I tend to read that a lot. It's got a lot of comic book ads and Magic the Gathering <laughs> oh, shit. card um, oh, okay. promotions in it and stuff, so <laughs> You're really uh you're really into uh MTG right now, aren't you? God damn! You got 816 pounds, though, dude. Hey, that's pretty good. That's real good. What were you? 1524. Wow. Yeah. I was a fat motherfucker. Yeah. All right. Well, that's Consumo. Chris Ham just uh, demonstrated the awesome monstrosity that you might be able to come become. Become. To become. To come become. So do you get as big as those bros? Yeah. Dude. They look like Mr. T when they're walking on their side. Yeah, at 1,500 pounds, you're huge on the screen. It's really hard to collect food at that point. Well, all right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this little bonus round of Consumo. Oh, wait, 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 what, wait, wait, what, what, what? You could see where they were playing um, Warhammer 48K right here. Oh, funny. <laughs> <laughs> Walk around the nerd den really quick. There's all sorts of weird shit in there. There's, like, model airplane up there. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, this is V is for victory. All right. Punch, oh, is this like punch a... that guy in the face? Yeah. Oh shit! You got in trouble by the boss oh, nerd. Comic book man's pissed at me. All right. Well, we'll see you guys next time.